Hi, this is a video of how to put your car seat into the back of a car. Once you've unwrapped your seat, which is what I've done in my other video, if you go to the back, this is all rolled up. And once you've unraveled it, it's all rolled up at the back. Once you've unraveled it, you see there's a hook on there and a strap, a buckle. And you also have another one on this side. What you have to do is make sure this goes down the side, clips in the side belt guide there. And the same with this one, take it around the side, and slide it into the belt guide there. Then this long strap comes up around the front here and we'll go and put it in the car. The back seat of my car, there's my Isofix slot so we have to pull a clip out there and pull a clip out of this one. That's ready to slot the seat. What I would advise is to push your front seat forward as far as you can to give yourself plenty of room. Right, we're going to put this in the car now. What I would advise is make sure your seat is facing forward where your slots are here for your Isofix bar to come out. They slot out like so. Okay, see they come out on a mocking position. That's that side. But we'll do that. Once we get it in the car. Right, just place the seat in the car at the moment. As you can see, we've got the Isofix bars slid out and locked out ready. Put the seat in the right position. The seat is in the right position. And you've got your Isofix bars lined up. Just push it all in until it clicks so it slots in. As you can see, I pushed that in now. Here they click and they slot it in. And you can see my little green tab to make sure there's a green tab on either side to confirm it's locked in. You have your long strap which comes from the back. So put that over the back, on the side there, over the back. I find it easier to take the parcel shelf out. And my clip that goes on the back of the seat. So what I'm going to do now, I'm not taking the parcel shelf out. I'm just going to slot it down in the back there. Make sure the strap goes down there. There it is there. What you do is just hook it. Sometimes they're in the back of the seat, um, hooks, I suffix. Sometimes they're in the back of the seat, sometimes they're in the floor by you, whichever one suits you. You've also got your strap coming back out then. Pull that tight. And it's coming out back through the top. Oh yeah. You should take that over there. And go back around to the car from the back now. And this is your clip, which clips into there. Once you can adjust it, once you've adjusted it to the right length, the child's in the seat, you've strapped your child in the street, and clip it onto there. Clip it on there nice and tight, now you can pull that even tighter if you want. Like pull in the excess belt, as tight as you want it. That makes the seat secure, secure it at the bottom and it's secured by the when you want to get the baby out press those two clips by here push them forward which detaches that 
attached to the strap there. You can now go to the bead, but the best thing to do is the red button at the back there. If you turn, if you press that, as you can see, the seat will turn to make it easier to get the child, your child out. When you put your child back in, put the baby in, strap it in, press that red button again and the seat will start to turn. It's locked in place. Get the strap and pull that tight and then connect it up there and you're all set to go. What I would do with the excess strap here is just feed it back over here and feed it down in the back. What I would do with the excess strap here we've got left is actually wrap it round here once or twice. See I've wrapped it round there once or twice. Now I'm going to roll it up from here. See, I've rolled it up now, wrapped it around there, used the Velcro to hold it up there in place. The baby in, your child in, you connect it up these and there, and you want to tighten these straps here. You just pull on this tab here, and it pulls these straps. You see the strap moving? Pulls the straps in tight. And that's uh, to make the straps fit comfortably around your child. Hope this helps.